Hi everyone, today I'm here to show you how to use GL2 AST on your Samsung Galaxy Grand running 4.2.2 firmware the latest one, leaked version. Okay, so for that we need at first we need to install GL2 AST from Play Store which is the latest version and uh, let me tell you this uh, for working 4. Point, for working the GL2 HD on 4.2.2 you need the latest version because uh, the older version does not work on 4.2.2 okay so first download GL2 HD from play store then follow this Okay, as you can see uh, here I have downloaded GL2 HD on my grand and uh, this is running the latest version firmware which is 4.2.2 Okay, so for uh, using GL2 HD, actually what GL2 HD does is uh, it just copies the data or the ob file of your games and apps from your internal drive to SD card okay so for perfectly working on GL2 SD at first you need to do something that is go to settings and to device and display and uh, make the screen timeout to at least 10 to 30 minutes as it will be necessary so I prefer uh, setting the timeout to 30 minutes because it takes quite a lot of time for copying those files so it's better to turn the screen on because sometimes uh, in the past it happened that uh, the screen gets locked and uh, that copy of the file stopped in the middle and that creates a problem it's better to set the screen timeout to 10 to 30 minutes ok now open GL2 HD you need to be rooted for using GL2 HD ok um, as you can see I have already mm, transferred my off file and the data file of modern combat 4 to my SD card that's why it's saying as play over here ok first and foremost Okay, first and foremost you need to press this button and here it says move data now it shows a list of now it shows a list of uh, games which are currently in my phone okay so suppose I want to move this virtual tennis so for that just select this virtual tennis okay so select this virtual tennis and press move and here it start copying uh, the virtual tennis file as you can see uh, the copy has been started so let's wait sometimes and uh, I think this is the simplest way to copy any games to your SD card and this is the most easiest way of them all but this things uh, this GL2 HD is quite a headache because you have to move each and every single game one by one that things quite a lengthy procedure okay 70% uh, is over let's wait a few seconds
Okay, let's just turn off the Wi-Fi. Okay. As you can see over here now, another game name came Virtual Tennis. So for playing this game, at first we need to press this button, this mount, mount button. Here you can see it says mount. And after playing the game, you need to press this button, which is unmount. Okay. So if you want to play the play the game, just press this button and it mounts the game and just press play So as you can see the game is working just fine so before quitting the game you can oh I want to show you one more thing and you can do two things that before um, quitting this GL2 SD you can press this button unmount okay another thing you can do is by going to settings here and uh, here is an option here is an option uh, if you can see unmount when exit okay this option is quite important uh, if you don't press the unmount button and uh, then also when you quit the gl 2 sd it will or when you get unmount but if you say if you don't uh, just if you untick this unmount when exit then what you can do is uh, you can play the game from this icon this icon over here virtual tennis but if you tick this unmount when exit then you can't play the game from from oh shit if you, you can't play the game from this icon so every time you need to open GL2 HD and play the game by mounting here and play. So if you don't want this hassle, it's better to go to settings and untick this. Okay, it's as simple as that. Okay, uh, this is how you can use GL2 HD. And uh, I hope you like this video. If you like it and if you feel this easy and if it's helpful to anyone feel free to comment down below thanks a lot this is onindo bye take care